I'm just saying. <laughs> All right, and we're going to keep these temperatures above average once again for today. And we're going to have that sunshine out there as well as high pressure builds in behind that cold front. But that cold front this morning is bringing in some spotty showers out there. So take that into consideration as you're stepping out and about. You will definitely need that, that rain gear this morning. Some light shower activity embedded moderate showers coming in, but high pressure is definitely going to be our friend as we head towards the afternoon. So here are those showers that I'm talking about starting to fizzle out a little bit more. So that's something that we like and you can actually see the clearing line back off towards Thermont. So already starting to erode some of those clouds out there. The temperatures this morning ahead of that cold front. Oh boy, numbers have really bumped up. We're looking at 61 degrees in Frederick, 61 in Hagerstown, 52 in Deep Creek this morning and Frostburg's coming in right around 58, 62 in Annapolis, and as we head over towards uh, Centerville, East End, those numbers in the low 50s there, we should be at 39, 38 degrees now for our lows. So we put that into perspective, and you can see that those numbers are well above that. Speaking of the numbers, gust forecast will ramp up as we go throughout the day. We'll have those gusts up to about 20 to 25 miles an hour before it's all said and done, and those winds will be out of the northwest with that uh, fropa or that frontal passage. The future cast, not going to do a whole lot today. But then as we go into tomorrow, we'll pick up more clouds as we go into the afternoon. And then we do have a couple of sprinkles as we head towards the evening on your Thursday. That's getting us ready for that stronger cold front that's going to move in as we head into Friday. So Friday morning, we will have some heavy rain and possibly maybe even some thunderstorms coming in here. And then we start to dry out a little bit more as we head more towards the afternoon time frame. So we will get some dry time on your Friday. And then by Saturday, we will have more sunshine in the forecast. But that cold front is really going to drop those temperatures temperatures as we head into the weekend. I'll show you that in just a matter of moments, but the dog walking forecast everybody look, 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 look at little Kobe. Kobe has on its Lakers coat. <laughs> Lakers. I can't. He has on his Lakers jersey right now. This is such by Nicole Barnwell. Thank you so much for sending this picture in. If you want to send me in your pictures, you know what to do. Charles at WMAR.com. I'll put them on. Kobe has a great day for that dog walking forecast. Just wait till the rain passes, Kobe, and you'll be just fine as we will see that high temperature coming in about 70 degrees before it's all said and done today. A seven day forecast has something for everybody. So if the 60s and the 70s are a little bit too warm for you, do you like seasonal conditions? I think a lot of people do. We'll see that on Saturday and then we get even cooler as we head into your Sunday, Monday and starting next week. Let's get a check of the traffic with Laura.